the introduction like what is sap what is sap mm what is s4 hana so we are understanding that and uh, then we will see how the user interface will work and <coughs> sorry and uh, how we will navigate between that that we'll see then there will be let's say about the subject of the sap mm so we will discuss what is the organization structure so navigation and all will be seen then we will be looking into the organization structure how the organization structure will be there and how it will build and uh, then we will be looking into the master data what kind of master data are there let's say material master vendor master or let's say business partner and uh, purchasing info record and others we'll see that one then we will understand the procurement process what kind of procurement processes are there in sap mm so that we will be understanding and uh, then we will go to the inventory management then we will see the inventory management so inventory management is nothing but maintaining the stocks and managing the stock receiving the stock and issuing the stock these kind of things will be there so let's say goods received goods issue and transport posting physical inventory these will be the topic the, okay so basically invoice verification then we will be looking into the let's say evaluation of the material and pricing material ledger and uh, next we will be looking into the some of the integration topic let's say let's say integration with the finance integration with the sd module and integration with the pp module so that we will be looking into it then if possible uh, sorry then we are going to look into the some of the reporting some of the standard report and some of the custom reports that will look into it then we will be looking into the let's say batch management serial management and uh, let's say uh, split valuation special procurements uh, material requirement planning so these kind of topics will be seen then there will be let's say while we are discussing all of this so we will be taking some of the real world scenarios and case studies what kind of issues you can get inside that topic and what kind of things will be there so we will understand that and uh, then we will be having the project classes also inside the project classes we will be discussing the real world scenario of let's say implementation in the support project how the implementation project will work and how the support project will work so those kind of things also we will be discussing and uh, you can also prepare for the certifications and uh, we will also see what kind of helps are available in the let's say in, from the sap what kind of helps are available and in the normal we websites how you can get help while you are getting some issues getting some troubles how you can handle those kind of things so those things also we will be discussing so this will be mostly the course topic 